Hello friends, today we are going to learn a really easy trick that you can use to memorize the clausius clapeyron equation. So if you use this trick and if you keep it in your mind, you can easily recollect the clausius clapeyron equation just like that whenever you need it. So first let's check out what is the clausius clapeyron equation and see how it looks. So you can see that it is a natural log of P1 by P2. P1 is vapor pressure at temperature T1 and P2 is the vapor pressure at temperature T2. So the natural log of P1 by P2 is the enthalpy of vaporization of that particular substance by a, divided by a constant R into 1 by T2 minus 1 by T1. So this is the whole equation. So if you look into it, we can see that there is a top portion and a bottom portion and there is an analog. So let's see how we can make a trick to memorize this particular equation. So a good idea is to make two tricks, two separate tricks to memorize the bottom portion and the upper portion of this equation. So that when we write down the two different tricks together later on, we you can unify them to create this equation very easily. So first let's create a small simple trick to memorize the top portion of this equation. That is the lo natural log part P1 delta H and the occurrence of 1 2 times. So we can just imagine it as 11. So let's see what's the trick to memorize this upper part of the equation. That is long people hate November. So just imagine Long means just if for the timing, just imagine tall people, really tall people hate the month November. That means the word long has the letters L and N. So you can remember that natural log symbol and people starts with P. You can use it to remember P1 and the word hate. You can use it to remember the enthalpy. And the word November, November is the 11th month, so you can use it to remember the occurrence of one, two times. So long people hate November, this is the trick to remember the upper portion of this equation. And now let's make a trick to remember the lower portion of this equation. Here we have just four letters, that is P2, R, T2 and T1. So to remember, let's come up with a new trick. And that is Pop ran to Thailand. Just, just imagine the pop running to Thailand and long people hating November. So this, these two tricks can be used. In, the lo in this new trick, we can see that pop starts with the letter P2, or P, so we can use it to remember the uh, first letter P2 and the word ran, we can use it to remember the constant value R and 2 and Thailand are starting with T, so we can use it to remember T2 and T1. So always the greater number minus the lesser number. So you can just uh, uh, infer that T2 will come definitely before T1. So otherwise you will get a negative number. Just imagine like that. So these are the two tricks. Long people hate November and Pop ran to Thailand. It's really easy and simple to remember this equation. You can uh, by using these two tricks. So I hope you all learned the clausius clapeyron equation very easily using these tricks. To get more such tricks, just subscribe to our channel and hit like. Thank you.